How do, ladies and gents? Freddy Adu here. Welcome back to Can Freddy I Do It Better, where I see if I can take on jobs in football and do better than the managers are doing in real life. First up, Pep Guardiola at Manchester City this season. And the answer, as you can see from here, so far is new. Um, ninth in the league after five matches played. Uh, two wins, narrow wins against Everton away and Swansea at home. A draw at home to Middlesbrough and uh, defeats to Burnley and Liverpool. Uh, yeah, not great. We're going all right in the Champions League. Uh, if we just go over to the competition screen, uh, Champions League, we're, we're top of our group. We beat Monaco away 2-0, which is a really good result, especially since Monaco are absolutely flying um, in real life. I don't know if they're that good because I'm using the starting data because I, I, you know, I'm taking Pep's job, so there's no January update to the start of the season data. But our Champions League group is stacked. Monaco, Real Madrid, Ajax. We'll do well to that, get out of this group, so that's a really good start. But today, in today's episode, we have the EFL Cup third round at home against Leicester and then West Brom, three days later, West Brom away uh, in the Premier League with an eye on that next episode, which is going to be a whopper one. Two big home games a couple of days apart. Uh, Ajax at home, followed by Arsenal in the league at home. Looking at how potentially important all three of those will be. Um, indeed, there are two following. And you know what? Just, just important games all over the place here. I think I'm going to have to sacrifice the EFL Cup realistically and so in this first game of today's episode I don't think it's going to be that strong a team that we're going to be putting out. You'll be forgiven for not remembering this because it is it has been a while since I played this save, apologies, it's been a while since I've done much on this channel, I'm really sorry about that, I've been busy 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 but uh, you might remember that Aguero is currently injured, uh, lower back stress fracture, he's out for another two to three weeks, three goals in three games, 7.9 yeah, gonna miss him. Uh, Ian Acho in his place has played seven and scored one with one assist at uh, 6.7. Yeah, please hurry back, Sergio. Minor spoiler alert here for the series. I set up uh, my desired team way before I actually show it to you. I'm gonna show it to you immediately before the game. Um, with an eye on playing an entirely rotated team against Leicester in the Cup, I put Jesus Navas in for the first time this season and he immediately sprained his ankle whilst getting tackled. Fucking great. Nolito wants to discuss personal matters, I imagine, about a lack of first-team football. Um, indeed, I, I've put you in the first team for this next game as well, so hopefully you drop that. Thank you. But, as somebody probably once said, every problem is an opportunity in disguise. And Raheem Sterling has been dire this season, so he can come in to try and find some form. The rest of the team, Willi Caballero, Zabaleta, Adariboyo, Stones, Angelino, uh, Torre, Delph, Garcia, uh, Sterling, Iannaccio, Nolito. So a really good mix, I feel, of experience and youth. Um, but if they play their first team, they will probably beat us. Uh, Navas needs to come off the bench. They've got left back, centre back, defensive midfielder, attacking midfielder, winger, all around midfielder. If we don't really have a gap then. Maybe, maybe a right back, maybe Sanya. Yeah, fuck it. Sign you onto the bench. All right, let's go. Now, the more obvious gap that we had in that bench then was a striker, but we don't actually have another fit one, so never mind that. We're evens here at home against Leicester. Uh, let's have a look what team they've put out. Uh, Zila, Hernandez, Be Benaluani, uh, Morgan, Fuchs, Mendy, Mares, Amate, Matty James, um, Damari Gray and Vardy. So pretty, a pretty strong team. Uh, they don't have much stronger team. They're not in a 4-4-2, which is odd. Um, I don't know. I think they might turn us over. I, I'm honestly, I'm not. I'm not that fussed. I just what what I'm more looking at for out of this is for some out of form players to get into some form, and I'll see if I can actually say that to them. Um, mm -hmm. Nope. Let's go for that one then. Oh, none of them care. Uh, let's go for passionate. And I think there's more to come from you because I do. But a lot of these players, I expect more from a lot of them. Come on. Now it is Bank Holiday Sunday, and after um, hours of perfect silence all the, all throughout uh, the block here, and indeed silence all through yesterday, even through the boxing, even though it's Saturday night, um, it's just now as I start recording that people start playing music. So apologies if you can hear that. Uh, we force a corner there, but Nalito puts it straight to Zila, and immediately a highlight for them. Mares with a free kick, left foot takes it in, headed away, only as far as James. He puts it back in. Good header from Vardy into the top corner. 
Was it Vardy or was it Morgan? It was, yeah, it was Vardy. I thought it was Vardy. It looked like Morgan was celebrating there. But um, yeah, there you go. 1 0 Leicester. <laughs> Two minutes in. I was pretty much right, wasn't I? Pretty much right on the money. So there's a really good ball back in from James. Vardy climbs. Great header. Fantastic header, son. I'm quite where my centre, centre defenders are Jones and Adriboyo. I haven't got a clue. But hey, never mind, right? Here they come again immediately. Mares to Damari Gray. Well won Sterling. Okay, come on, lad. Use that pace. Someone break with him. Someone get up there with him. Fuck me, Ianacho. Where are you going? Okay, you get in there now. There you go. Okay. Never mind, Ianacho. <laughs> I'm sorry, mate. Never mind. Good run. <laughs> well timed. I knew it all along. I had complete faith in you. <laughs> That's actually a really good counter attacking goal. Sterling won the ball. Uh, deep in his own half. Ran away from all the defenders. Mares trying to close him down, doing a little bit of a lazy job about it. Gets to the byline. Great ball across. Zila could maybe have done better. Ianacho nods in to an empty net. Number 72. I bet you 72 adds up to 9. Bet you. Footballers, man. So, playing on standard flexible, as we are at the minute, we've scored. Uh, our goal was a counter-attack. Um, but we are having more of the possession. So, I think we're just going to switch it up. To control and fluid, what are the instructions that we currently have on? More disciplined. We'll take that off because we're playing all right. We'll keep the higher tempo. Actually, no, we won't. We'll knock it back to normal. Uh, we'll keep the more closing down, though. I quite like that idea. And let's actually play with a little bit of width, shall we? Let's try that because we had a bit of joy down the wing for our goal. Uh, we'll calmly uh, get back out there. There you go. And actually calmly again. Uh, looking for you to make the difference. Okay, there we go. Good stuff. Oh, it's all green. Let's just not do a striker's one then. All we can do is hit it from here. And as soon as we go into control, they start having all of the possession. So, that's about to be their highlight, so I shouldn't really do it now. Let's just wait and see what this is. Hernandez with a long throw in. Head away by Boyo. Delph. Got a bit of space out here on the left. Let's keep an eye on that. Is he an Acho? Hold it up a bit and pass. Yeah, find the leader. Okay. Just running to a dead end. I'm gonna I'm gonna take that risk and do it now. Uh, we're gonna go back to what we were before because we were dominating the game and doing better. Uh, we were on more. I don't want to put discipline back on, but I will turn the tempo back up. So this highlight is going to continue. Zila hoofs it forward towards Vardy. Boyo wins the header, but only to a Marty. Looking over the top for Vardy, who's surely offside. Great save, Caballero, but linesman, where's your flag, buddy? We're going to get a replay of that, I think. Oh, maybe not, actually. Mara's to take the corner. If something comes to the corner, then we won't get a replay. If, something, if nothing does, then we will. Caballero claims it easily. So we should get a replay of that. He looked to be some way offside, which is becoming a theme for me in this game of late, if you've been watching the York City videos. So let's just actually try and watch. We'll just keep an eye on Vardy. Okay, we can't because the camera angle changed. Okay, Zabaleta might have been playing him on, but it didn't look like it, to be honest. Good save, Caballero. I did look at making changes a couple of minutes ago, but I don't really want to waste players on this game that I don't really care about. We're, we're going, it looks like we're going to get to full time drawing, and then obviously going to extra time. I might play some of it. Might bring some bigger guns on for extra time. Whoa, they're pushing us here. They've they've dominated possession in, over the game overall now because of that late spell. Uh, I'm going to calmly. Uh, I'm going to I'm going to calmly tell them I'm not happy. Yeah, good. And we're going to make a couple of changes. Uh, let's actually switch back to this asymmetrical formation because <laughs> I do like an asymmetric formation uh, Delph, Torre, Garcia there so Nolito is the odd man out and so he can come off for our best player, Kevin De Bruyne uh, attacking midfield on attack do you two want to be the other way around? yes you do I think and we'll start extra time like this so a free kick towards, this is from the kickoff highlight it could be nothing, we'll find out now it's nothing. So half time and extra time, we have quite a few tired players, namely our midfielders. So we're going to make changes to both of the midfielders right now. We'll bring in Fernando, uh, yeah, DLP, and Fernandinho for Delphi's box to box. Are you better the other way around? You're far better the other way around. Let's do that then. Yaya would have been a really good penalty taker, wouldn't he? Oh well. Dominating the ball here in extra time all throughout it, but. Nothing of interest has happened. It is penalties. So first up, wow, Fernandinho has got great penalty taking and composure. So he can take our first one. 
then De Bruyne, Iheanacho, Stone's the all-important fourth because of that composure. And then on fifth, we will go Zabaleta, uh, Fernando, Angelino, uh, Alish, Sterling, Boyo, and Caballero. Let's go. So Kaputska, first up for them. Caballero, save it. Oh, he nearly did. He nearly, nearly did. 1 0 last day, they take an early advantage. Always prefer to go first in penalty shootouts. Fernandinho, for us. Come on, mate. Oh, he fucking caught it, mate. He caught it. Vardy, great penalty. We're going out of the League Cup. I'm kind of happy about it. <laughs> kind of happy about it, if I'm honest, because. I don't really care about this competition and it frees up dates for us. De Bruyne, good penalty, mate. Um, yeah, I don't really give a shit if we do go out. I've said that at the beginning. I'm not just saying that now because we're losing. James. Oh, he's put it wide. Matty James, dude. Come on, pal. We're back in it. Ian Acho. Left peg. What you got? It saved. It lagged for me. <laughs> and he saved it. Zila. Two decent saves. Okazaki. He won't miss. Yes, he will. <laughs> I know nothing. Oh, Kazaki straight down the middle. Caballero stood still and saved it. So we are still on track if Stones puts his away. And he doesn't. Zealous having a fucking blinder. Jonathan Stones. Score to win for Christian Fuchs. He's good from dead balls. <laughs> Caballero. Caballero. Caballero, uh, you're not good enough today. There you go. Yep, whatever. Don't really care. And so to the game that does matter, and this is how we're going to line up. We're going for Bravo, Sanya, Company, Otamendi, Kolarov, Gundogan, Fernandinho, Delph as a three-man midfield, uh, De Bruyne, wide right as advanced playmaker. Hopefully that'll work for him. Uh, if not, we might have to move him inside and reshuffle a little bit. Sane on the left and Iheanacho up top. Will we win this game? I fucking hope so. Away against West Brom, though, is never easy, as anyone who watches the Premier League knows full well. They're difficult to beat on their own turf. So their team, they're going for Ben Foster, Neon, Dawson, Evans, Galloway, uh, from York City fame, uh, Jakob Berahino on the wide right, uh, Darren Fletcher, James Morrison, Nasa Chadley, and Rondon up front, I presume, as a target man. I've got company back, though, so I ain't too worried. Craig Dawson is also carrying a bit of an injury. What kind of injury? A knee injury. That could come into play. Let's let's uh, actually ch chuck a cheeky hard tackling on him. And passionately, we are the favourites. None of them care. Passionately, I have faith in you. I do. I have faith in you. Keep the passionate, positive feedback coming. And hopefully they will de develop a strong relationship with me. So still watching from kickoff here. Is anything going to come of it? No. Neon. Cut that out. Okay, so we've dominated the ball. 23 minutes in. We have a free kick. Fernandinho. Delph. Iheanacho make a run. Eyes come to feet. Sane. Back to Fernandinho. A little bit cagey. De Bruyne's got a bit of pocket of a space, though. These kits are a bit difficult to tell apart, if I'm honest. Oh, great run from Sanya. Picked out as well. De Bruyne's in the middle. De Bruyne scores. Advanced playmaker on the right. It does appear to be working for him. He's coming inside, allowing Sanya to overlap in. Sanya did it brilliantly just there. Well found by Gundawan. Chadley lets him run. That's really poor from Nasser Chadley. But Sanya, great touch. Great ball across. De Bruyne getting across the near post. Ben Foster hasn't got a prayer. Good goal. One City. One City? Man City 1-0. <laughs> That's what I was trying to say. One City. This possession is very, very good that we're having here. But we're not really doing too much with it. Um, I'm going to tell him not to get complacent, calm, good, it's all green. Once again, we're still watching him kick off here, Rondon. Can, trying to find a bit of space, Chadley has a bit of space, Sanya, watch him. Gundogan's going to get sent off, 30 seconds into the second half. Ilkay, what are you doing, brother? What are you doing? Oh, okay then. Bit of reshuffling will be required. I don't want to fucking watch it, do I? Right. I think we're just going to drop in to a 4-4-1. Drop Sane back to a normal wing, which he's also perfectly comfortable with. Uh, play De Bruyne as a wide... In fact, no, we won't. We'll just play him as a winger on support. No, we won't. We'll play him as a wide playmaker on support. Um, 
Delph no longer box to box, just central midfielder. Mm. Yeah, central midfielder on support and then deep mind playmaker on defend Fernandinho. Okay, that will do. Ian Acho, can you play complete forward, mate? You can very well. Good. Do that. So still, it looks like it might be our attacking highlight here. Delph. Delph, well done, mate. Oh, good tackle, though. Is Berahino and Nyon. They're going long for Rondon. He's dropping... Oh, Robson Carney, that is. Sorry. Is Rondon still on the pitch? Yes, he is. They've gone to two up top by the look of it. Well in there, Sanya. It's only come as far as Neon though. Looks forward for Rondon. Headed on. Company headed away. Can we get out here? Looks like we might be able to. Ine Nacho, just hold it up, mate. Hold it up. Hold it up. Okay, there's no one coming to get with you, so yeah. Never mind. <laughs> that might become a problem if I let it. If I let uh, Ine Nacho get too isolated up there. Uh, we've got some tired legs in midfield, so I think we'll have to swap them out. Um, both Fernandinho and Delph, both looking very tired. I only really have Fernando to bring on. Oh, Yaya as well, obviously. Idiot. Right, yeah, so they can both come on. Fernando and Yaya, both in in the midfield. Uh, anyone else, especially knackered? Not really. So we'll leave it at that for now. We'll leave the roles the same as well. I have passionate faith in you. Yes, felt encouraged by the continued positive feedback. That right there is what you want to be seeing, guys, because that will develop into uh, feels he has a good relationship with the manager, which means that you get a positive reaction pretty much every time you tell him anything. You need to develop that, you need to nurture that shit. Now with 10 minutes to go, well, four minutes to go, Christ, that just flew past. <laughs> I am actually gonna drop us, uh, we're already playing very, kind of well, defensively anyway, I'm actually gonna drop us on two defensive and uh, a little bit more structured, just to hopefully hold on to this. Uh, we've got a sub left, so we might as well use it. Um, Players in defensive position. In fact, I'm going to take. Mm, I'm going to put Nolito on for De Bruyne. Actually, no, Nolito can't really do it. Let's put Sterling on instead then. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Let's put Sterling on instead then. And uh, he can just go to being a winger uh, on support. You know, a bit more mobility up and down that side. Let's hope. He can just help us see out the end of this game. There you go. Another felt encouraged by continued positive feedback. Keep tonguing their assholes, guys. Oh, right at the very end, they have a corner. 40 seconds left. Berahino puts it in. Headed away by company. The fucking monster. No one's pushing out, though. Robson Carno plays it back to Berahino. Back to Olsen. Fernando doesn't do enough. Here's Fletcher. Back heel into Rondon. Tackle. He went down, but he, nothing given. Can still get to that. Just run for a corner, mate. Run for a corner. Run for the fucking border. <laughs> I'll play it back to Torre. Torre's got half the pitch to himself. Excellent. That's going to be the game. Another 1 0 win in the league. If we can start getting these play badly win 1 0s, then we will find ourselves shooting up this league despite still being rather poor. And we can find that we can then from there find form. Uh, it'll be annoying to have Gundogan out for probably what one maybe two games uh, I'm gonna I kind of want to say this I should go with that you know yeah there we go gain focus I think feel like that's what we need this team needs to gain focus it's not really doing it uh, at the minute to the level that it should be I'm gonna struggle to get back into the team I'm gonna be assertive and I'm gonna um, uh, I'm going to say that, yeah. I'm not really going to be because he's a really good player, but I'm going to say that to him. You know, book your ideas up, kid. We're still in ninth, though, uh, but we are now on to 10 points. If we can start uh, putting some wins together, which we have been in the last couple of games, if we can start putting wins together regularly, we will start moving up this table. I mean, Stoke are currently top, um, so you know, no disrespect, but I don't think they'll be staying there. Um, Watford, actually Watford on this game tend to do really well. So there aren't that many other teams above us really that you would expect to fall too much further down. So we will have to get up there on our own merit. But then again, we are three points off the top. So early days, very early days in the season. Uh, so far, can Freddy I do it better? The answer is still no, for now. If you want to see how I get on uh, further down the line, join us next time for more. Hit subscribe so you don't miss anything. I'll see you around about... <laughs> Oh, I fucked that up, but whatever. Peace. <laughs>